we have arrived to our destination. Today's video, dorks, we are going to Party City to check out some Halloween costumes. Hi dorks, it's another Halloween shopping video and I thought let's go to Party City. I used to love going to Party City as a kid and like looking at the whole display of all the Halloween costumes and I always wanted to like, it gave me such OCD as even a little kid like what do I want to be for Halloween. Then I know they have some also really cute decorations and I actually I need something part of my Halloween costume because this year I'm going to be Ginger Spice. All my friends from the valley are we're going to get together on Halloween. We're all going to be the Spice Girls and I was chosen to be Ginger Spice. So can help me pick out some accessories for Ginger Spice. Come on dorks. Well I just got greeted with an awesome jack-o-lantern balloon. Thank you. It looks looks so good in here. My little Halloween heart got really happy. Okay guys, let's <laughs> There's so much to look at. I really was not actually expecting a lot, dorks. Um, you got a ghostly, spooky girl. I don't know, I don't think she's animatronic, but um, I don't like anything with like hair in the face because, oh goodness. And the, so the rising ghost woman is $149.99. So maybe she is animatronic, but maybe she's just not on. And right here we have, oh, Georgie. Poor Georgie. We all float down here. You'll float too. Reveal pop it. So that is Georgie. So he's $159.99. Got a cool looking. Oh my god, now they're all alive. Oh dear. I gotta get out of here, guys. <laughs> that wasn't the best scare of the, of the season so far. Wow. Well, that guy right there is... Please don't do it again. <laughs> oh my god, this is $1.99. <laughs> Alright, I gotta go. I gotta keep going, guys. Oh my gosh. Wow, there is so much Party City. Wow, I'm like shaking a little bit still, you guys. Sorry if my camera's a little shaky. That I was not expecting to get that scared, you guys. So it looks like we got some more of one of my favorite things, which is Halloween lights. I'm so glad you guys all like my Halloween tree. So much. And we got all the prices right there for you guys. <gasps> I like the little ghosts and jack o' lanterns. Cute, cute. Done for me, yeah, over there, party wow, you guys, they have a lot at Party City. We've got some more dead looking doll hanging things and some spiders. And then I'll come over here. Looks like they have some masks. Wow, 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 wow. We got the changing. Ooh. <gasps> Love it. Oh my gosh. Ooh, creepy. What have you done for me lately? Get it, Janet. Ooh, yeah. So I got some window decorations. Spooky setting. I know my husband's really into like all the gore stuff, which makes me really happy. But I, you know, having a little soon to be one year old, I just don't want to scare her just yet. So right here, guys, as a kid, my goodness, I loved just staring at all of them. I was like, where am I going to be for Halloween? And actually, Sophia does not have a Halloween costume yet. I have no idea what I'm going to dress her as. I mean, she'd be pretty cute as a little pumpkin. Oh, my gosh. Got Spider-Man, Captain America, Ant-Man, Wakanda Forever, Black Panther. Batman. These looks like these are uh, boys, infants, girls. Oh my gosh. This just brings back so many memories. <laughs> I was like, I want to be number 315, which is a My Little Pony pink <laughs> Pinkie Pie. Oh man. She's so great. It is probably one of my favorite things of the Halloween season is really dressing up and not just a mouse, duh. Mm -hmm. 
All right, we're moving on. Looks like we're going under a fairy section. Fairy. All looks like they're about $40. And now we're gonna move on to the Disney section. I went through all phases. I was a clown one year and like a rock star. Even one time I was Peter Pan and Thumbelina. I did it all. And I'm gonna be now Ginger Spice this year. Pretty darn cool. So it looks like if we are gonna, or someone will, will be doing uh, trick or treating, they have some great looking bags for only 99 cents. That's not too shabby. I really like it. I really hope we do get some trick or treaters. Maybe I'll just like tong the candy <laughs> and put it in their bag or something, or just scoop it with like, you know, a like soup bowl, spoon, or whatever. What are they called? I what they're called. Okay, now we're under adult female. Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm such a classic girl. I love like the witches and like, I was a devil once for Halloween. The scarecrow is really cool. And look at how much it comes with too. And I think the price is $40 for all of that. You includes a tunic top, hat, collar, robe, belt, and then it says to accessorize with a wig, makeup, and footless tights. Kind of helps you out. Of course, we have our Sanderson sisters. I mean, $50? I mean, that's like really legit. So I would not be mad. If you are doing a Halloween party, a social distancing Halloween party, I definitely go for it, you guys. Oh, V. Even for Dennis, probably one of my favorite movies. Oh, speaking of Scream, there's Ghostface. The music's playing in the background. What's your favorite scary movie, guys? What is your favorite scary movie? Yeah. Scary, like scary, woo, -woo, woo spooky. So the Golden Girls is like really having a comeback or they just really got hyped like throughout the year. So you guys can be a Golden Girl. I didn't ever watch the show, but from what I've seen, it seems absolutely hilarious. I think shout out to um, Jackie from Super Thews. She was, I think, Robin Hood for um, her little Halloween costume for Disney World. So, but yeah, I already have my Halloween uh, costumes. Like it's a little red leotard because that's what Ginger Spice kind of, you know, she wore those type of things. So I'm looking for a boa and maybe some like 90 like hoops and some makeup maybe. Speaking of boa. <laughs> okay, that's kind of nice. Because I'm obviously I'm wearing red with sparkles. And this boa is $20. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. So it looks like we're under the 1920s gangster flapper section, which I think I had been once for Halloween. Got some wigs. You guys, there's a lot. So if I'm panning a little too fast, I'm so sorry. But I just want to make sure I get everything for you guys because there's so much. I was not expecting this much, you guys. I really, really wasn't. <gasps> Wouldn't my husband look super cute as a Warren Connie's man? Um, baby, I think, I think, I think you should. But it looks like we're getting more in the creepy zone than none. I was once Freddy Krueger for, Hall <laughs> for Halloween. <laughs> you know, like sexy Freddy Krueger. That's pretty much it. Got some Michael Myers. And like a lot of these costumes are gonna be between probably $30 to $50. There's, there's like this whole section, all this. There's other boas, which makes me happy, but we have more over there. We have more like for Halloween parties. Oh my gosh, if you guys have a cute, oh, I just got distracted. <gasps> Look, your eyes can dress up your little pup. I wanna dress up my kitties, but I don't think they'll, they will uh, enjoy that too much. You guys have cute little animals for only $15. It can be a unicorn, jack-o'-lantern, a bat. Oh my gosh, I love it. So up here, it looks like we have more masks. We have Day of the Dead, Black and Bones, Slasher. We got Chucky, Michael Myers. I'm really tempted just to have a Michael Myers mask. Just to have, you know what I mean? I mean, it looks like we got some props over here. Try me. Okay. Ooh, bloody drill. I, I, I made it myself. 
Love it. If you want to be a, a gangster, or you get your gun, or you can be a ninja. I mean, perfect. This is the time to wear a face mask. <laughs> You, you got you gotta laugh sometimes you really do to, despite the world being crazy right now you just gotta find some comedy so you guys can be a ninja or a samurai now this is what i love about party city my ocd is so happy everything is color coordinated and it's beautiful it's just absolutely gorgeous from and it's like actually what makes me even more happy if you start Correctly, it's the rainbow. So we got the red, then the orange, then the yellow, and then the green, blue, purple, like. Oh. So I'm thinking actually a red boa maybe, or black boa. So this one's a little bit more, um, this is one's least expensive, less expensive I should say, and it's $10, so actually, oh. Was that a 90s thing? I don't, would Ginger Spice wear that? Oh, you guys, oh my gosh, this is perfect. I am gonna dye my hair, but I don't think I'm gonna obviously go fire and gin ginger spice red, but I well, I just feel like that's that's totally ginger. Okay, I think Ooh, I'm getting really excited now. I might just buy that. Here's the thing, if it doesn't work out, it's only $1.29, and then you can save it for you know next year or you know for fourth of July because it's red. So I'm digging this boa and I'm also digging this. The only thing is I'm also gonna look for, ooh. Ooh, maybe, maybe. I would do a wig, but I just don't, the wigs can be really, really uncomfortable if it's not put on correctly. So, but that's, okay. So thumbs up for my ginger spice accessories. So let's keep moving on guys. Oh, okay. So I am in the near future, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to taste of Halloween. And I was just thinking of maybe wearing my witch outfit like I did last year for Oogie Boogie, but I was thinking like, why not just be a little bit more simple? Cause it might be really hot. This little jacket liner headband is super cute. And it's only $2. So I might, or maybe I can just be a cat for Halloween. <gasps> oh goodness, so many decisions. What to do, what to do. I have to think about that now. Hmm. Kind of like the cat. I kind of digging the cat look. We got some more headbands. Oh, look, they have really fun, cute masks. Oh, goodness. Maybe I will be a cat. You guys, look, I can get a cat mask and wear my awesome um, romper with the... Okay, I think that that might be the winner. Okay, honey, I'm just letting you know I'm getting a little bit more than I usually do, but, you know, I'm doing two costumes at once. All right, let's move on. So looks like we got some more accessories if you want to be a sea siren. It looks like that is about $30. Like I said, the, the range for prices probably for costumes is going to be between $30 to $50. And we got an awesome sexy devil accessory kit <laughs> with the wings. I love wings. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. I went through a phase where I wanted the wing tattoos on the back. If you have that, you're, you're a rock star because they're beautiful. Look how pretty. You guys can be a black angel, a dark angel. Or you can be a light angel. And you can have white wings or gold wings. Or you can be a cute little angel that looks like a butterfly. Oh, there's just so much. I did this last year. I kind of did like the jewels for my witch outfit and it actually stayed on throughout the whole night. So that's something to think about if you just want something a little bit more easy. Okay, it looks like <laughs> got some kitty stuff. Tiger, cheetah, sexy kitty. Oops, sorry. This looks like this is a whole like what animal section. If you really love Mean Girls, it was October 3rd yesterday. You can be a mouse, duh, or you can be a cat or a bunny, or you can be a zombie ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> what does the fox say? Ding 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 ding. What does the fox say? 
Wow, if you ever have a masquerade party, these are really nice. And for $20 for the voodoo deer mask, wow, not too shabby. Some more mask. If you're a Phantom fan, you can be Eric. Got some more wings and things. <laughs> more masquerade looking masks are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Always that kind of reminds me of Ever After with Drew Barrymore, the Cinderella story. It's one of my favorite scenes, uh, scenes where she is up there and she says, just breathe. Ah, oh, I say it to myself all the time, just breathe. Just breathe and just keep swimming. So we're almost done. I'm on the end of it all. We got some really cute little signs right here. Ugh. Oh, I am done decorating you guys and maybe we'll do a video on of what we did um, maybe more towards like Halloween so like it's and maybe like during like Twilight so you can see all the lights and such got some cute scarecrows so over here we have a neon section so very 80s digging it we got some your bodysuits and shorts for your costumes and over here we have the pink section <laughs> This makes me so happy, you guys. I don't know why. I love color coordinated stuff. We got the golds and the silvers. So pretty much this is, you know, you got your makeup, accessories. You can literally just be like, I'm gonna just go silver for Halloween. And you have it, you have it all. I, uh, I'm so excited to get that. So, so excited. Here's a black bow. So you guys, ah. Uh, I think I want to do, because I have black platform, so I'm thinking I need to bring a little bit of black in, or maybe even white. My sister said white, and I think that is actually more ginger spice. She was really loud, loud and beautiful. Oh, and then maybe I should, maybe I should keep the red dress and then maybe accessorize with white. And the beauty is that you guys won't really see my shoes anyways, like I'll show them, but I'm thinking I'm going to do that instead. I think so. Wow, I'm really thinking really hard about this. <laughs> and then we have a rainbow section right here. Very Jabberwockies. And then purple, blue, green, yellow, orange, red. Party City, you really made me happy. You really, really did. And you actually scared me. <laughs> I was really not expecting that at all. So over here we got some kids masks and some you know makeup you know for your kids to do so it's not like full-on makeup and uh you guys i think that's it we got some more looks like um trump and i think that's biden right i think so i i'm not really into politics <laughs> i really do live in a bubble but um yeah i got some you know your ymca hat hat construction hat and firefighter hat Hot dog. Cute, cute, cute. So it looks like I missed one quick section. Um, if you love your Halloween socks, which I do, I'm really a sucker for those right there. Um, they got them here too for like three dollars. And got some beanies. I, uh, Tristan really loves his beanies. And then if you want to go Hawaiian for Halloween this year, you totally can. It looks like we have a little bit more of um, costumes. We have heroes like doctors and firefighters and police officers. Then we got your Western, your cowboys and cowgirls. I just love how organized they are here. Oh, you're under arrest. Excuse me. Excuse me. <sighs> little cowboy hat. Cute, cute, cute. So you can go steampunk pirate. And then we got some classic. Oh, we got some Renaissance stuff. We got some capes if you need a cape for your witch outfit or your vampire outfit. Oh, I think they would look good in that too. Love it. 
I do love the gothic look. I really, really do when it comes to like actual like costumes, you know, it kind of reminds me of like Anne Rice's like Interview the Vampire, Queen of the Damned, you know, a little bit of like Underworld. Love, love, love. Jack the Ripper type of situation too. You can get your studded choker. <laughs> or you can get tattoo sleeves. Maybe David should try that to see how you would look with a tattoo. And yeah, guys, that's, I think that is everything we have. Um, let me go on the other side really quick. Alrighty then. You guys can be Ace Ventura. <laughs> I, that's so great. You can be Ferris Bueller. Okay, we got some little um, comical 80s stuff happening. Oh my gosh, you can be Mrs. Doubtfire for only $34.99. I can't. <laughs> you can be a four-year-old virgin. Oh, Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> Discman's Disco. Neighborhood nerd kid. Oh my gosh, I can't. I'm, I'm actually looking for um, David to have a 90s grunge look because, you know, Spice Girls is 90s and he can just be something 90s. We got a padded suit cheek, so, you know, baby got back. <laughs> Tour skin, this is great. This is, this is making my life right now. You can be Bob Ross. You can be cook, uh, a cookie couple. You can be Flo. I can't tell what that says. That looks like sorority stuff. I'm digging it. Sherlock Holmes. Oh, she's gonna be a Wonder Woman, how cute. You can be an oversized belly. <laughs> oh, to wear a fat suit, how fun would that be? And now we're kind of getting into the 80 section. Exercise kit, muscle pants. Inflatable guitar, you can have one of those. Loving it, loving all this 80s accessories. Can be like inflatable boom box. And now we're kind of heading into like the more 70s. 60s. Groovy baby, groovy. And now we're heading in towards the 50s. I was once a pink lady for sure. Does it make me look smarter? Nah, you can still see a face. <laughs> it's okay, baby. It's fucking and rolling and whatnot. <laughs> I, could, I can just stay in Party City all day, you guys. Looks like we have some for your party um, decorations. You can make some fun looking alcohol ice cubes. <laughs> you can have a cool looking seance party. Do some tarot card reading. I'm here for the booze and that's only $2. This is great, you guys. Ooh, you can have a creepy Walking Dead kind of vibe. Or it, I should say. Help me. Oh yeah, this is it right here. Oh, and now we're getting into <gasps> Nightmare on Elm Street. Wow, Party City. Gosh, and you got The Shining. You got Friday the 13th, you got Halloween. Wow, and oh, we're not done. Oh no, we're not done, you guys. We got Nightmare Before Christmas and Beetlejuice. Holy smokes, you guys, Halloween is right around the corner and Party City just made it even more exciting for me. And you just got some cute little, just easy, happy Halloween. <gasps> I like that, maybe I'll come back and use some of that. <gasps> Oh, I also been thinking of Sophia's first birthday. Goodness, 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 there's so much. Trick or treat. <laughs> okay, picking up where I left off under like the 80s, uh, 70s, 60s, 60s, 50s section. On the other side, um, it's very, um, I guess you can say medieval time, Game of Thrones, 300 
kind of section, or I mean, you can also be a muscle shirt. Looks like they have um, a Cleopatra section, which is really, really cool. Ooh, you can be like Medusa. Ooh, I like that. And then now we're gonna get more into like a little kid section. We got some Dr. Seussa and some trolls. My Little Pony, even though it's not my My Little Pony, 80s My Little Pony, but if your kid's into that, they have great little accessories and costumes right here at Party City. We got some Snow White, Jasmine, Rapunzel, and Ariel. Very cute. You don't have to spend too much money at the Disney store. You can just come here and get something for like $8, which is great, I think, honestly. Sometimes we all have to be on a budget. Uh, I was once a fairy. I was trying to be Tinkerbell, but it kind of failed. But I have been a fairy once for Halloween. And if your kid is also into the Descendants, they got a cute little section there. I know my cousin one year was, um, I think, Ursula's daughter. I got Moana. More villain stuff. And also we got a cute little buzz. And you can be... <laughs> ADD. You guys can be um, Dustin <laughs> from Stranger Things. But you can be a dwarf from uh, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Got some more uh, Disney uh, zombie and trash. I'm trash. And looks like we have a cute little Harry Potter section. If I was in a house, I would definitely be a Hufflepuff for sure. The one thing I kind of wish they had, here's some cute Harry Potter glasses, was um, more Coraline stuff. I would actually have loved to have been the other mother. We got a little bit of Star Wars. Also got a little bit of Avengers. And it looks like we're getting um, towards the DC. We got some Joker stuff. Ooh, that's a creepy joker mask. Goodness, goodness. Ooh, you can be a uh, Supergirl or Catwoman. Love it. Or that could be Batwoman. That might be Bat, Batwoman. <laughs> Batgirl. <laughs> the Ninja Turtles. Super Mario or Luigi. Got some, looks like we got some video game and anime characters. <laughs> and you guys, um, I think we did it. Yes. Yeah, we did it. Obviously, Party City is known for your party favors and, you know, doing Halloween. Um, I mean, birthday parties and celebrations and anniversaries and obviously their balloons. I look at that awesome jack o' lantern balloon. You guys, if you have a party city, come to Party City for sure. Hey guys, I just purchased, um, I got the white boa and I got a black tiara because I know Ginger Spice is just, she's so out there and she thinks she's like the woman of girl power. So I went with a black tiara and I think it's gonna look really, really cute. My glasses are fogging up. They look really cute. And I got um, a little pair of Halloween socks because actually one pair died and I needed a new one. So <sighs> guys, Party City, if you have one near you, I, I highly recommend to go check it out because it, it was more than I thought it was. I got scared, like legit scared of those animatronics and it's so all nice and organized. You can ask nicely, you know, I would like number or whatever to try in a Halloween costume. I guess they're still allowing to do those, especially for kids. Um, go check it out. Go check out Party City, guys. So if you really liked this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. And if you're new here to the Royal Dorks, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And you can ring that notification bell and you can categorize it to all where you're notified every time a new video comes out. You can check out me under the Royal Dorks on Instagram and my husband's under Twitter, the Real Duke of Dork, where we're posting a new video coming out and doing all things Halloween and eating and being with our, our baby. So thanks, you guys. Hope you enjoyed. Happy Halloween. Stay dorky. Bye.